Once you have verified your motor direction and set your limits, it's now time to learn the 1050 control board. To begin the learn mode, first press the functions button. As you see, learn is the first option, so you can now press OK. Using the up and down arrows, select whether you are working on a swing gate or a slide gate. In this example, we will select swing by pressing OK. Now you must select the gate's weight type by choosing light, average, or heavy. In this example, we will select light. As you notice, the screen now says Learn Enter, indicating it's ready to be learned. Press OK to begin its process. First, the control board will scan for any blue bus accessories installed, which in this example, they are none. Next, the control board will begin to learn its limits, first by slightly opening up the gate, then turn around and close the gate, all the way to its closed limit. Once it reaches its closed limit, it will then reopen the gate until it reaches its open limit. Then, finally you'll reclose the gate at full speed to the closed limit. Now, we are free to test the procedure by pressing the open button. As you can see, the motor percentage climbs to 100% as the gate opens. Once the auto close timer kicks in, after the default 10 seconds, you can now see the gate close as the motor percentage drops down to 0%. And now, you have successfully learned the 1050 control board.